Well, two local Boy Scouts are working pretty hard to become Eagle Scouts, and their path to earning that rank has taken them into the wooded area that's around the Hope Institute in Springfield. ABC News Channel's Glenn Marshall caught up with these two Scouts. He's live here in the studio with more on what they're doing. Now, Glenn, I've heard of a Boy Scout, but what exactly is an Eagle Scout? Well, Marianne, an Eagle Scout is a scout who possesses the capability to, capability to show leadership while helping the community he lives in. Two local Boy Scouts are on their way to earning that title. They're trying to become role models for the younger generation of Scouts by paving the way for them. And they did just that today by creating a nature trail. Sam Childress and Zach Wyden are on the verge of acquiring badges that hold high honors with the Boy Scouts of America. The Eagle Scout Project uh, is like a defining moment of leadership. The two boys started their Eagle Scout project a couple of months ago. They decided on making a trail and building wooden benches for the Hope Institute. Boy Scouts usually choose Eagle projects that will hold high value to the community that will use it. Zach kept this in mind when he decided on this project. And I wanted to make one that have lasting impact because these benches will last 20 years. We had How to like up it. it. Did you do that? Yeah, we had to like up it a little bit. <laughs> I think it was like a day or so. That's crazy. It wasn't that bad. A true eagle project should do should maximize how much it can help. And I thought this project in itself would be something that could have a great impact on you know the school. Did you line the whole trail with these things, the logs? No, that was unintentional. That was unintentional. <laughs> Hope Institute's backyard is filled with a wooded area. Now the children and the Boy Scout troop at the school will be able to enjoy nature close to home like never before. Our scouts are already making plans for campouts down at the fire ring and cookouts and, and already making plans for ways that they can utilize this trail. I left my mark on history. Okay. <laughs> Hope Institute students were able to pitch in with laying the wood chips down on the path. Sam Childress recently received his Eagle Scout badge for the part of for his part in the project. Zach Whiting will find out soon if he passed as well. Back to you, Marianne. Yeah, I'm sure he did. Thanks so much, Glenn. Well, the boys also bet made bets with their fathers before starting the project, and if they both pass, which they probably will, they're going to be able to get their driver's licenses.